sort of a trouble. There's some River Plate players have been sprayed with gas as they were coming out for this second half, and you can see, in the case of Driussi, there's uh, tears in his eyes. It appears there's been some gas that made its way into the tunnel. According to Marcelo Gajardo, he's apparently told Fox that uh, gas came in from the stands in towards the tunnel. And Vangioni is the worst affected. This is incredible. Well, Barovero is telling the rest of his squad to come out. Well, Fangioni seems very badly affected by this. The tunnel is now being torn to shreds by a few Boca fans, and that's where the problem came. According to Marcelo Gajardo, there was some sort of a gap opened up by supporters, and the spray came through onto some of the River squad. We're told it was uh, in the form of some sort of orange spray that came from the stands and got into the tunnel there where the River players were coming out of. So there's no doubt, you can see fans behind who are covering their the noses. They know something's going on. I, I think it was something perpetrated by one person. One fan has caused all this. Well, actually, just look at that mark on the back of uh, Ponzio's shirt. It got him in the eyes, perhaps, but obviously it got him in the back as well. That orange spray that we were told about, that might well be it. Seems to have uh, hit some of the players. I think Fangioni, Ponzio and Martinez. Let's look at that. Well, we've seen some... Extraordinary things in this competition, abandonments with referees hit with missiles and obviously the uh, Sudamericana final in 2012, the second leg abandoned at half-time because Tigre's uh, dressing room was stormed by police at half-time. Well, Aru Barena is pleading with Marcelo Gajada for the second half to be played. It may go down as a nil-nil, and that would be it. River would be into the quarter-finals, as the attack obviously would have been carried out by a number of persons supporting... Uh, we use that phrase loosely, Boca Juniors. And it would penalise Zerua Barena and his side, there's no doubting that. It does appear that nobody seems to want to make the final call. Somebody is going to have to. Well, Dario Herrera has just said he wanted the game to continue, but the final decision has been made by Conmebol, and they say the game has been abandoned. As you can see, spectators are now beginning to leave. Well, the official word used is suspended it may yet happen that the second half gets played at a later date but it is suspended there will be no more play tonight so as it stands and as it may well finish on the night Boca Juniors nil River Plate nil River Plate one nil up on aggregate and if it stays like that we'll be back next week with Cruzeiro against River Plate thanks for staying with us but from Will Downing, a very good evening and what has been another very sad night for South American football.